Happy Holidays from your friends at the Humane Society of South Central Michigan, located on Watkins Road in Battle Creek. We are the area's nonprofit advocate, sanctuary, and source for companion animals since 1887. We believe in second chances at the Humane Society of South Central Michigan. Staff members at our facility provide care for up to 100 animals every day of the year. Our days start at 8 a.m. Every area is thoroughly cleaned and disinfected. Our shelter pets stay for as long as it takes to find a loving forever home. During their stay, they receive a consistent, high-quality diet, regular examinations by a veterinarian, and lots and lots of love. Prior to being available for adoption, animals are spayed or neutered, heartworm or feline leukemia tested, microchipped, dewormed, and dogs are kept on heartworm preventative year-round. These kittens were found inside a box that was taped shut and left near the railroad tracks. Your support has given them a second chance. If you look at them, you would never know they had a rough start in life. They are brave and playful. We know they will find great homes. We can have up to 60 cats in our building at any one time. Our longest cat resident is Jangle. He receives Christmas cards from all over the world and has more than 2,000 followers on Twitter. Most of our dogs and puppies are transferred to our facility from high kill facilities in other areas. These pups arrive with their mother and are now available for adoption. Our staff members are the family of our shelter pets during their stay. Hi, my name is April. I've worked at the Humane Society for 13 and a half years. I'm a kennel tech slash veterinary assistant. I have here is Paprika. She's a five and a half month old Chihuahua mix. She's a little on the shyer side. She has a few siblings left here also. Uh, she is a little shy when she meets new dogs and she needs some work to come out of her shell. But when she does, she's a very, very playful young girl. Merry Christmas. Hi, I'm Sarah, and I'm the front desk receptionist here at the Humane Society of South Central Michigan. I started working here in February this year, and that is the estimated date of birth for this big guy right here. This is Fenton. We think he was born in February 2020. He's an awesome little guy. We just got done with about a mile of trail running after playing in the play yard for a bit, so that's why he's panting like that. He's working on his leash training and conditioning. He is a powerful guy and he doesn't really believe in personal space if you can't tell that right here. He likes to be right next to you all the time. <laughs> he is available for adoption and with some work and training and boundaries, he's going to be the right guy for the right person. I do believe he couldn't be sweeter and he's very tolerant about almost everything. So if you do think you're interested, you can check him out on Pet Finder or Facebook page. And if you have any questions, give me a call. Our phone number is posted on our website as well. <laughs> Hi, my name is Chevy Rocco. Uh, I've been working at the Humane, or I'm an administrative assistant in Kennel Tech. Um, I've been working at the Humane Society for six years. This is Link, and I think Jack. <laughs> um, she is a female domestic short hair gray. <laughs> she is very sweet and cuddly. Um, She spends most of her days sitting on the house over here, looking at the birds, and she needs a forever home for the holidays. Hi, my name is Rachel Bammer. I am a kennel tech here, and I've worked here for two and a half years. This is Pepper, he's five and a half months old. He's a Chihuahua mix, and he is Paprika's brother, and Poppy's brother as well. Merry Christmas. Hi, my name is Morgan. I am one of the front desk receptionists here at the Humane Society and I am also the volunteer coordinator. I have been here for about five years, going on six, <laughs> and this is Ambrosia. As you can tell, she's a little skittish, um, but she is one of our longer residents here. Uh, she's been here for about a year. She's about two years old, almost three. Uh, she was a mama cat. She's very sweet once she gets to know you, and she is just looking for a perfect fit. Hi, I'm Grant, and I'm a kennel technician here at the shelter. I've worked here for a year and a half, and this is Bernie. He's a Pyrenees mix. He's about eight months old, and he's a really mellow dog that enjoys getting attention from other people, and uh, will follow you just about anywhere to get it. 
and uh, he loves playing with his ball. He loves the rubber balls. And uh, he also likes uh, watching all the other dogs play in the dog park while he's outside. Hi, my name is Melissa Sawyer. I'm the finance director and HR manager here at the Humane Society. I'd like to talk to you about my friend Sage here. She happens to be my office mate. She came in five years ago, five and a half, um, with a litter of kittens. All of her kittens were adopted. So she's six and a half years old now. She's a typical Siamese. She's got a little bit of a temperament. Um, she's not great with dogs by any means. Uh, she would prefer not to be with another cat, but I think it could work out. But naming all these bad points, she actually has some really good points. She is my buddy. She does like to be petted. Um, she's telling me she wants down now. <laughs> but she has she has her playful spirit. She just likes to, to lay around and uh, lay in her bed and just hang out. But she is a really good kitty. And I'd just like to say happy holidays and have a great day. Bye-bye. Hi, I'm Francesca Nielsen. I'm a veterinarian at Humane Society of South Central Michigan. Um, I'm just rechecking a dog we treated for heartworm. Her name is Ada. Um, and she'll be going home with a loving family today. So we're just checking her out to make sure that she looks healthy before we let her go. Hi, I'm Carrie Bammer and I'm the Animal Care Manager here at the Humane Society of South Central Michigan and I've been here for about 13 years. Um, and this is Jake. Uh, Jake is, we have him listed as a Catahoula uh, hound mix, and he, but he possibly could be Aussie hound mix. Um, you can tell by his pretty coloring um, that, you know, there's definitely a, a herding breed in there. Um, he does have a lot of energy. He's about seven months old, six to seven months old. Um, he, uh, he has recovered from Parvo. Um, it's a really big deal for us because treating Parvo in a shelter is almost impossible, as a lot of people know, um, but it is totally treatable. And thanks to great donors and to veterinarian help here in Battle Creek, we were able to save this sweet boy. And as you can tell, he has a lot of energy. Um, he does know how to sit, and he walks pretty well on a leash. He loves his toys. Um, he does. Uh, he does. He loves his toys. He loves squeaky toys. Um, he responds very well to any. Um, commands that you give him. Um, right now I'm not going to command him to do anything because you really need to see Jake in his full personality and this is what it is. Um, so, you know, I'm grateful to all of our board members. Um, you guys do a great job uh, supporting us, um, helping us with uh, whatever we need done around here. Um, and I'd like to thank all of our uh, people who follow us on Facebook, uh, Twitter, um, Instagram, everything like that, um, all your great comments and all your great support and all the great donations that people bring in all the time. We couldn't do this job if it wasn't for you guys, so thank you very much.